Welcome to the Transitions Daily Podcast. Transitions Daily is an online recovery group that offers a daily distribution of popular recovery resources accompanied by a secret Facebook group for discussion. We hope you enjoy today's readings. This is Transitions Daily for April 25th, read by Buddy C. from Atlanta, Georgia. AA thoughts for the day, self-restraint. Nothing pays off like restraint of tongue and pen. We must avoid quick-tempered criticism and furious power-driven argument. The same goes for silent scorn. These are emotional booby traps baited with pride and vengefulness. We can neither think nor act to good purpose until the habit of self-restraint has been automatic. 12 Steps and 12 Traditions, page 91. AA thought for the day. The seven T's. Take time to think the thing through. AA acronyms. Action. Any change toward improving one's nature. Just for today. Choices from Use Me. The voice that answered was calm and sweet beyond description. You have the strength. All you have to do is use it. I am here. I am with you. Use me. I was born again that day. From that moment, the compulsion was lifted. In the 11 years since, I have found in sobriety what I was searching for in the bottle. I wanted peace. God gave me peace. I wanted acceptance. God accepted me. I wanted to be loved. God assured me that he loved me. Came to Believe, page 33. Daily Reflections Entering a New Dimension In the late stages of our drinking, the will to resist was fled. Yet, when we admit complete defeat and when we become entirely ready to try AA principles, our obsession leaves us and we enter a new dimension. Freedom under God as we understand Him. As Bill sees it, page 283. I am fortunate to be among the ones who have had this awesome transformation in my life. When I entered the doors of AA, alone and desperate, I had been beaten into willingness to believe anything I heard. One of the things I heard was, this could be your last hangover, or you can keep going round and round. The man who said this obviously was a whole lot better off than I. I liked the idea of admitting defeat, and I have been free ever since. My heart heard what my mind never could. Being powerless over alcohol is no big deal. I'm free and I'm grateful. As Bill sees it, essence of growth. Let us never fear needed change. Certainly, we have to discriminate between changes for worse and changes for better. But once a need becomes clearly apparent in an individual, in a group, or an AA as a whole, It has long since been found out that we cannot stand still and look the other way. The essence of all growth is a willingness to change for the better, and then an unremitting willingness to shoulder whatever responsibility this entails. Grapevine, July 1965 Big Book Quote There is a principle which is a bar against all information, which is proof against all arguments, and which cannot fail to keep a man in everlasting ignorance. That principle is contempt prior to investigation. Alcoholics Anonymous, 4th edition, Spiritual Experience, page 568. 24 hours a day, AA thought for the day. I don't believe that AA works because I read it in a book or because I hear people say so. I believe it because I see people getting sober and staying sober. An actual demonstration is what convinces me. When I see the change in people... I can't help believing that AA works. We could listen to talk about AA all day and still not believe it. But when we see it work, we have to believe it. Seeing is believing. Do I see AA work every day? Meditation for the day. Try saying God bless her or him of anyone who is in disharmony with you. Also say it of those who are in trouble through their own fault. Say it willing that showers of blessings may fall upon them. Let God do the blessing. Leave to God the necessary correcting or discipline. You should only desire the blessing for them. Leave God's work to God. Occupy yourself with the task that he gives you to do. 
God's blessing will also break down all your own difficulties and build up all your successes. Prayer for the day. I pray that I may use God's goodness so that it will be a blessing to others. I pray that I may accept God's blessing so that I will have harmony, beauty, joy, and happiness. Hazelden Foundation, P.O. Box 176, Center City, Minnesota, 55012. I'm Buddy, and I'm an alcoholic. We hope you enjoy today's readings. You can also receive Transitions Daily via email and discuss today's readings in our secret Facebook group. So for more information, go to dailyaaemails.com today. Other than the 24 hours a day reading, unless otherwise specified, all quotes copyright Alcoholics Anonymous World Services, Inc. 1952, 1957, 1967, 1973, 1975, 1976, 1980, 1981, 1984, 1985, 1988, 1990, or 2001.